Hi, my name is Patrick Regan. I live in Anchorage, Alaska, and I am 26 years old. I have a neuromuscular disorder called spinal muscular atrophy, or SMA. My SMA makes the muscles closest to my spine weak. It affects many of my physical abilities. But, it does not affect my ability to think and understand things. Because of my SMA, I need to use technology. I use a wheelchair for mobility. I use a ventilator to breathe. And I use augmentative and alternative communication to communicate with others. Augmentative and alternative communication, or AAC, is anything that a person uses in addition to, or in the alternative, to using their voice to communicate. I use many ways to communicate including a speech generating device with eye gaze, like I am doing with you right now. But, I also use other methods to communicate, such as partner-assisted scanning, where I use a communication partner to say the alphabet and I indicate yes to the letters that spell what I am saying. I also use facial expressions, gestures, forming the words with my mouth and sounds to convey what I want to say. I have a very good memory. I am good at using computers and software. I am hardworking and reliable. I think that it means accepting yourself for who you are. My SMA is part of who I am. I think that people should accept that and not expect me to be any different than how I am. I also think that disability pride is being proud of who we are. It means having the rights to access and inclusion. And a voice in the things that matter. One way that I make sure I have a voice, is that I make sure that I vote. I have voted in almost every local, state and federal election since I turned 18, and I encourage my friends to register and vote. I have had many people who have helped me and encouraged me in my life. My friend Tan is one of those people. She is a lot of fun. but. She is also a very hard worker, and she helps me with projects for Big Tech. My friend Ali is also someone who has helped and encouraged me, especially when we were in elementary school together. My friend Tyson is another person who has been very supportive of me. They are not exactly role models, but they have had very positive influences on my life. I am a senior media tech, and the media tech coordinator who schedules media techs for St. John United Methodist Church in Anchorage. So I run the slideshows and media for the services and special events at the church, and also make the schedule for the media techs. But I was not able to do that job when we were hunkered down because of the pandemic. I am also the coordinator of activities and events for bridging communities through alternative communication. We call it Big Tech for short. Big Tech is a group of adults who use augmentative and alternative communication. And Big Tech is an adult outreach program of the Bridge School in California. We have members in Northern California, Oregon and me in Alaska. We support each other in using our multimodal communication, and do outreach in the community at large to educate and get the word out about augmentative and alternative communication. 
My job is to steer the leadership committee of Big Tech. I schedule and lead our meetings, make arrangements for our activities and events, and I am the main contact person for the group. I also work very hard to try to include everyone in the group and make them all feel welcome and valued. I love music and musical theater. I go to the symphony and the concert association performances. And I go to comedy shows and sports events. And I love to travel. I love to read and do research on my computer. My advice is to do what you love to do and try many different things. Don't let anyone tell you that you are not capable of doing something that you want to do. You may have to try different ways to do it, but still try.